Welcome back, Thurgood Marshall students, to our last episode of the AM for the 2022-23 school year and the last day of school. You've worked hard this year and I know you're excited and we look forward to spending this last half day with you before we all go on our summer break. And students, even though we have a half day today, our mission and vision hold true. Our mission is that all of our students would unlock their amazing potential by working together to create an atmosphere of academic excellence and a culture of support, belonging, and growth. And students, our mission still holds the same. We want all of our students to be academically, socially, and emotionally ready to thrive and attain their future goals. Students, as we do every morning over the announcements and as we do every week uh, over the AM, let's take a moment and pause and reflect on what we have left of the school year and maybe what we're going to do this summer and maybe our goals for next year as we pause for our moment of silence. Thank you. Please stand and join us as we recite the Pledge of Allegiance. Let's begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. All right, now it's time for our last day announcements. Not much left today, uh, but students, just a reminder, it is a half day. We'll have a brunch schedule. Um, you'll go through on a schedule with your teachers and have brunch. And then we'll be dismissing at 1225 today, starting with our car riders. And speaking of dismissal, just a reminder that today is our eighth graders last day in the building. And so in keeping with that tradition, uh, we will do the walk today. And so um, the deans and uh, your grade level team leads will give you information on how that's gonna work, but you have an opportunity to um, just uh, say goodbye to our eighth graders as they take a walk through the building and as they are the first to exit the building for the last time. And so students, we want to thank you for a great school year. Uh, we are excited about next school year and uh, just the exciting things that we have planned for next school year. And just, uh, we want to take a moment this morning to take a trip down memory lane in our 2022-23 school year. Enjoy the next video. How do I
and I'll take graders we will not miss oh, you especially oh, diego oh, and oh, all oh. his little crew natalie i'm gonna miss you baby bye eight. hello eighth grade it's miss smith um you guys are so awesome i'm so glad that i actually got these four years with you all don't know what i'm gonna do without you guys you guys are so talented and amazing in your own ways thank you so much for everything and you will definitely be missed love you thank you Say bye, Ed Bye, Ed Bye, 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 and you came in as little boys and girls in the fifth grade and we had to deal with COVID and all this crazy online stuff. And now we've been back and we've been moving and wherever you end up in high school and college, just go on and do great things. And uh, the career arts team and especially Coach Gardner, Miss Sherlin, we love you and we're gonna miss you and we wish you to- Shout, shout out Mr. Martin. He's one of my favorite teachers this year. Shout out Miss Graff and Miss Moran. They were the best teachers I've ever had in middle school. And shout out to Miss Emery and Miss Tran, sixth grade year. They were the best online and offline. It was just a W to be in that class every single day. And thanks to Miss Wilson, even though she came in late, she was still one of the best teachers I've ever had. Thank you. Oh, hey. Okay, I want to shout out to my favorite teachers, um, Mr. McCurley, um, Miss Dotson sometimes, Miss Chambliss. Yes, and um, I just want to say I'm gonna miss them. And uh, oh, Emma Smith, I'm glad to be in eighth grade. I'm gonna miss middle school. I'm trying to miss a very and miss a wound and ever support because every time they'll always help me with my work and sometimes Jefferson. Um, because they'll always help me thick through thin, and I appreciate it. I, I appreciate them. And I just want to say thank y'all for being there and feel good next year. Hey, what's going on, eighth graders? This is Dr. Yarbrough. I just wanted to say congratulations on making it past middle school. You're about to enter into a new phase of life called high school, and I wish you all the best. Good luck. Remember that Marshall is always going to be home, so feel free to come by and um, holler at us anytime. All right, peace. Congratulations, eighth graders. I wish you well as you go to Cane Ridge High. Uh, remember to always make good choices, make good decisions, and be kind to others. And as I've always told you, be the change that you want to see in the world. Love you all. Hey, eighth graders, this is Mrs. Rex, and I want to say I'm so proud of you for your accomplishments. I think you're going to do great in high school, and I wish you all the best. Good luck, eighth graders, on your new journey. High school, you're gonna love it. But be safe and think smart. Good luck, eighth Bye. Good luck in high school. We wish you well. Go visit your library. They wanna see you. Read, we'll read, read. <laughs> Bye. Good luck in high school. Hello, eighth graders. I just wanna wish you the very best as you head on to your next chapter. We're so proud of you and hope that you love your next steps. Sorry. Hello, eighth grade. I am Mrs. Gwen Davenport, and I just want to say congratulations on making it to the end of your middle school year. 
Next year, you're gonna start ninth grade. You have four years, four years to be intentional about your decisions, to make sure you're committed to your work and to pick your friends wisely. Four years, guys. Don't let us down. We believe in you, we love you, and we're praying for, for the best. Come back and visit us. All right, good luck to all our eighth graders. Make good choices in high school. Do something with your life. Don't be foolish. All right, good luck to all our eighth graders. Make Hi, Mr. Allen here. Uh, just want to send you all off with some well wishes. I'm excited for this next opportunity. Um, you all are now a part of my past and I'm a part of your past. And so I'm looking just forward to see whatever uh, our futures hold. So good luck next year. I'm excited for high school. Make sure you come back and tell us all the great things you're doing. Congratulations. No matter where life takes you or what path you choose, you will always meet challenges. That is the way life is. There are no guarantees and no matter how many things you do right or how many rules you follow or how many you don't, choose the right road. You all are destined for greatness. I love each and one of you. I see good things in your future. Remember, you matter because your school counselor, Miss Sal, told you so. Good morning, Marshall Mariners, especially those eighth graders. I just want to say uh, congratulations and uh, I hope the best for each and every one of you all. Uh, and I just want you all just to remember those things, those important things that we have instilled in you all here at Thurgood Marshall uh, for your future. Take What's up, eighth graders? Mr. Hatcher, congratulations on being promoted to high school. Best of luck in your high school endeavors to each and every one of you. Have a quote that I want to leave with you. Be bold in pursuit of what sets your soul on fire. Farewell, eighth graders. Miss Henry loves you. Um, just remember to push through all obstacles, no matter what. You have greatness within you. So push through, be great. I love y'all. Y'all can do this. And have fun on your new journey in high school. Peace. Hello, eighth graders. Miss Chandler's here. I just want to wish you guys well on your future endeavors. I have a personal connection with you guys. Y'all are my virtual COVID babies. So I've grown a super strong love for you all. And I just hope that you remember all the great talks that we had, the things that I've tried to instill in you. Um, don't forget me when you guys reach your full potential and success like I know you are. Love you much. See you soon. Thank you. Have a great summer. Take care of each other. Be nice to each other. And uh, good luck in high school. Yeah, man. Y'all got to teach y'all night for it. Keep right, you know. I'm, I'm dropping out. <laughs> good luck. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm not. I'm not. Good luck. You're going to need it. Yeah, good luck. Really? You're gonna need it. High school finna be hard. Y'all don't know. It does get harder, but then it gets a little bit easier. Okay. So it'll be good. The slow. Just, just don't crazy. slack off, cause remember you need them credits. You need the credits. Hey, hey. Yo, you did it. Congratulations. Enjoy the summer. Um, don't do anything I wouldn't do, but if you do, name it after me. Peace. It's a bitter farewell, and I want to be honest okay. with you guys. I've said that about a billion times this year. We've had great times. I'm gonna come chase and follow you when you go to high school. And I really need you to be like Anuja and be hardworking, positive attitude, and here every day. I love you guys. I'm crying. Oh, damn what this means. Oh, is it Superman? What is under there? Oh. Stop, stop. This is strictly for my homeroom. They know who I'm talking about. She leave all her. <laughs> I want to say goodbye and farewell to all the awesome eighth graders. Not just these two, but the other eighth graders. Anusia, I see you, and I also see Erica, and the rest of you guys. You guys are awesome. I feel blessed to have you in my class. I feel blessed to know you guys, and I'm looking forward to your next educational, academic, and social venture. Thank you. Miss you guys. Hi, it's Miss Mills. Congratulations to all of you guys who are moving on to Cane Ridge, or Hume Fog, or wherever. Um, me personally, I'm gonna miss all of you, but especially my babies that I had in sixth grade, like Anusia, and then I got to teach again in eighth grade. I'll see you, and I'll cry whenever I think about you. Bye.
Well, hello, eighth graders. You were actually my first class here as when I became principal, you were fifth graders. So you're my first group to go fifth through eighth grade. So just really, really uh, excited on just how you've grown and the things that you've accomplished. Uh, the teachers have lots of positive things to say about you and we're just so proud and looking forward to just the many directions uh, that you all go and all very unique. You have some that want to be figure skaters to uh, future athletes to doctors to lawyers uh, and so I'm just excited about to see where you guys all end up and look forward to you guys coming back. Uh, it's really important that you come back and hopefully we have you as a guest speaker at one of our eighth grade celebrations. We'd love for you to come back and share your wisdom and remember your roots, remember where you come from. No matter where you go as you leave Marshall, you are always going to be a Mariner and we are proud of you and we love you and we'll always be here to support you. So best of luck as you move into high school and to college and career and beyond. And again, always reach out if you need some encouragement or just to kind of share where you are in your journey. We wish you well. Does that work? And now it's time for our quote of the week. And it's going to launch us off for the summer. And this quote is from Warren Buffett. He's the CEO of Berkshire Hathaway. The quote is, surround yourself with people who push you to do and be better. No drama or negativity, just higher goals and higher motivation. Good times and positive energy, no jealousy or hate, simply bringing out the absolute best in each other. So students, as you enjoy the summer, be careful who you hang with, make sure you're surrounding yourself with the people that push you to do better and be better. And that's gonna wrap up this year's AM. We love you, we appreciate this year. You all have worked hard, we've done some amazing things together. And for those that are returning next year, we look forward to another year of uh, learning with you together here at Thurgood Marshall. Have a great day and have a wonderful summer.